We've seen a lot of new pictures today of conditions inside border detention facilities in the lower Rio Grande Valley. And tonight, a state representative from Williamson County, Democrat James Tallarico, is telling us about what he saw Monday in West Texas and two other customs and border patrol facilities. One in El Paso, which holds women and families. The other in Clint, which holds children. Tallarico tells KXAN the women and children are being separated from grandparents, aunts, uncles, cousins, and siblings because they do not fit the federal government's definition of a family unit. Tallarico says he and other lawmakers want to change that. Phones were not allowed inside, so he described the facilities to KXAN. He saw children and women um, being held in tiny jail cells um, with you know, seven, eight people uh, inside one cell, hard concrete floors. Tallarico also speaking with other Texas lawmakers about how funds from the Texas budget are being used to improve conditions for people entering those border facilities. Our KXAN digital reporter, Alyssa Gord, has more on his visit for you. It's at our website, kxan.com.